Hiya. So it's a very interesting time at the moment because all of the secondary schools in Barnet, which is the area that I work with, um, they're all doing virtual open evenings, so virtual tours and virtually selling their school to you as parents. Um, I'm going to talk about Bishop Douglas today, which is in Finchley. Uh, they had their virtual tour last week. It was the first one that I went to, that I virtually explored. Um, so I'm going to read you some of my notes um, to give you an idea about that school. So the head teacher was the first person to come onto the screen um, and talk to us. Um, she was very stern and um, I'm sure she's very approachable. And she was talking about the expectations of the school and the culture. Um, it, she said it is very strict. It's a Catholic school. Um, no phones are allowed at all on the premises. So you have to hand them in in the beginning of the day and then you get them at the end of the day. And this is to, I think it's actually quite good. This is to prevent the kind of any interruption from social media, people sitting on their phones in class. Um, it hopefully stops all of that so the kids can be focused on the there and the now and be present in their lessons and in their friendships. Um, then the head of year seven uh, came and spoke and gave us a few facts um, that the country is seventh, uh, sorry, the school is seventh in the country for GCSE achievement. So it is a high achieving school and it's the first in Barnet for progress, which I thought was a really lovely um, additional comment. They also do Latin as an extracurricular um, subject, which is great because that's what I used to teach. So I'm all, all for that. Um, then there was a year seven student that came on and spoke a little bit about um, their lo love for science um, and saying their form is really supportive. The food is good. So that's good to know. Uh, and the homework was manageable. Uh, then another teacher came on who was the head of religious studies and talked about the Catholic and the the religious element of the school. So they do have mass, they do have choirs, they have Bible study, um, school liturgies and things like that. Then the head girl, Amber, came on and did a little talk. She talked about the diversity of the school and that they have academic, outstanding academic results and free school meals. Uh, it's very disciplined, but it's also nurturing. And she had been there since year seven, which says a lot when a child stays at a school for, for the entire career, their entire career. Then the head boy, came on, so I'm just changing my notes over. He also talked about the school being strict. So uh, we definitely know that's that's a fact. Um, he's also been there since year seven. He talked about the love and respect and in inclusion in the culture of the school, which is really important. Um, he said they were really good teachers and that there's an intimate relationship between the teachers and the students. And I did a, a video previously on how important that relationship is because the teachers are role models. They're not just teachers, they're role models for so much more. So it's really important to have good relationships with your teachers and it can affect your entire like or dislike of the subject. Um, he also talked about the safeguarding team and raised the issue of bullying. And he said that it is stamped on and dealt with when it arises. So that is really good. They have a very good uh, anti-bullying policy in place and that it's dealt with effectively. Then uh, the head came on again and talked about um, doing personal tours and then it went on to Q&A, questions and answers, of which I asked lots of questions, obviously. Um, I asked about which universities the kids went on to afterwards and the reply I got, because it was all via messenger, um, was that 25% of the students that go there do actually go to Russell Group universities, which are deemed very respected universities. And 84% of the students go to university after they finish at Bishop Douglas in their first year, which is also very high. Perhaps the others take a gap year, or they go straight into work, or they're doing an apprenticeship, who knows, but that's a very, very high um, statistic. It is a science specialist school. So if you really like science, Bishop Douglas is a consideration for you. Um, they do food tech at key, st key stage three. Not all secondary school schools offer that. Art, design and technology. Um, let me see what other notes I have. And that is it from me. There you go. Some notes, my feedback as I was scribbling down whilst I was watching the virtual tour. I hope that has helped somebody who was considering Bishop Douglas 
um, as a secondary school choice for your child. Watch out for my next video on Archer. Bye.